morning, so it's 10 a.m. right now, day five, and today I'm going to drive from Grand Junction to Colorado National Monument. Colorado National Monument is a national park with a lot of deep cut canyons, rock formations and it was always on my list. I really wanted to spend at least one full day over here. Just a pro tip, if you are someone who is light hearted, do not get into the National Monument Park using the eastern entrance because there are a really less number of side rails and it looks dangerous from such heights just do not drive do not look into the right side because it's going to really break your concentration let me just drive that way and i'm gonna show it to you right now Just about to start the rim drive it's going to be a long 10 mile drive I guess and this is where the National Monument Colorado starts you can see a lot of people they are busy with the cycles and stuff Pura family sara cycle, border cycle, choto cycle, papa cycle, ma cycle, chua cycle, kukuro cycle. Ooh, this one looks great. A moody cycle, re. My trademark color, black and green. Tap kitra puri ki nee jiu ho vuchi, khatra hai chhi. You better move down or reach reach. Only one got a one motor. And so it has got a lot of activities like bicycling, mountain biking, hiking, and you can get to the lot of top of the canyons as well. Let's drive. <laughs> Just reached the eastern entrance of the Colorado National Monument, United States Department of the Interior National Park Service. From here, the Rim Road route starts. Let's drive. Just reached the first lookout and look at this. Ooh. One, two, three. God 
Damn. It's crazy deep. Zoop. You can see some daredevils over there trying to pose and risk their life. Nice. Okay. All right. Let's get to the second lookout now. just reached the second lookout the name is red canyon and you need to look at this views just reached the fourth stop the fourth lookout and i'm driving the whole rim road that started from the eastern side of the grand junction entrance and it's going till the fruta and then going through the western entrance i'm going to exit the i70 going back to the Grand Junction Hotel. So here is a pro tip again. If you are driving the Monument Colorado, just make sure you are not using Google Maps or Sajik. You need to just put in the map as Fruta. Do not put as Colorado Monument because it's going to show you a drive of just around five or six miles and you are not going to see the whole canyon view. This was just epic, spectacular views, but yeah, you have to drive really, really careful. There are absolutely no barriers on the road. <sighs> dangerous, super dangerous drive, but you have to do this rim road drive. It's like 21 miles, starts from east, ends at west, and then you get back to Grand Junction Hotel. So, yeah, I mean, this drive is absolutely recommended if you're coming to Colorado. Ooh, look at this thing god damn so just approaching fruta downhill right now and you gotta see those views let's drive <laughs> with the drive so this was the last stop the independence lookout stop and this is how it looks I just came by that road and just going to go take this road downhill go 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 and my hotel is over there on the end you can see the ground Grand Junction City over there and over there my hotel is on that side i guess yeah so let's drive to the hotel now <music> Just reached the hotel back in Grand Junction right now. It was a tiring day, a drive of somewhere around 70 or 80 miles. And yeah, a lot of drive in the National Colorado Monument. It was absolutely spectacular. Drones were banned over there because it's a national park. So I tried to get some of the shots from outside of the main road of the eastern entrance, I guess. So here is a pro tip if you are visiting Colorado, if you are coming to Grand Junction, make sure you are staying at least one extra day here in Grand Junction because you are going to need a one full day for Colorado National Monument. Do not miss it. It needs a lot of hours of driving. You have to drive slow, you know, like 15, 20, 25. You cannot go fast because the roads are crazy dangerous. So. I absolutely loved it. I will just go ahead and edit the video, make Maggie right now. So see you guys tomorrow.